gentlemen, welcome to a sold-out show here in Green Bay, Wisconsin. And you could fit another fan in here with a crowbar. It's cheese heads as far as the eye can see. It sure is. Green Bay knows that they're about to see the greatest superstars in all of sports entertainment. I can't wait to get started. It's been a long time since I saw a crowd get behind a superstar the way they have for John Cena. Yeah, and that's great for him. But this is a match, not a popularity contest. I don't think Cena's got any problem being physical either. There aren't many superstars who can match his accomplishments. It really sticks in my crawl that CM Punk makes a big deal about being straight edge like that makes him better than the rest of us. I don't think that's his opinion at all. And if he does think that he's better than anyone else, I'm sure it's because of his confidence and his abilities, not his lifestyle choices. <coughs> Watching these superstars go at it reminds me why I prefer to stay on this side of the announce table. You know, if you let me train you, you could be cruiserweight champ inside a year. Oh, no. I've heard stories about the way you train people. You make Marine... Instead of pandering to the fans, you should really keep your head in the match. Come on. You're looking at a superstar who can feed off a crowd and use that energy to win the match. And there's the counter. He made his opponent look like a chump with that counter. Even if you wind up winning a match like this, you're going to be feeling it for the next week. Yes, but that's the case if you lose as well. And having to deal with emotional as well as physical pain is that much worse. Hey, it's pretty insightful for a guy who's never wrestled a match in his life. Well, I've been in the locker room after a match and seen the superstars who don't get their hands raised. You can literally feel the disappointment radiating off them. It's not a pretty sight. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest. You know, there's such a thing as playing to the crowd too much, and that's what I'm seeing here. I disagree. He's wrestled this match his way all along, and now we see it paying off. Cena spends a lot of time running his mouth. If I were him, I'd put that energy into improving my ring skills. Seen as a multiple-time WWE Champion, how much more improvement do you really need? Listen, One. if you're not constantly trying to improve, you're going to get overtaken by a guy who is. Two. Cena better keep that in mind. Look at this. <laughs> Pandering to the crowd. Nothing wrong with keeping the paying customers happy while you build some momentum. The adrenaline is pumping. The crowd is coming alive. This is what they came to see. Hey, try to restrain yourself a little bit, okay? You're supposed to be calling this down the middle. When I first heard about this match, I wasn't sure what to think, but these superstars are blowing me away. Really? As soon as I heard about it, I expected a tremendous matchup, and I haven't been disappointed. I didn't say I'm not disappointed. But I'll talk about getting stuck with you as a broadcast partner some other time. <coughs> I can honestly say that I don't think I've ever seen a superstar as exciting and dynamic as CM Punk. Come on. He's nothing but a tattooed moron with delusions of grandeur. That might be your opinion, but I think the vast majority of these fans would disagree. Man, I don't want this match to end. I'm with you, partner, but it's got to end sooner or later. Well, whichever way it goes, no one can say that these superstars didn't give it everything they got. Watch it. He reversed it. <clears throat> these superstars have been giving it everything they've got all night. They sure have. And that's where the superb conditioning of the WWE superstars comes into play. Yeah, you're not going to win a match if you're blown up two minutes into it. 
You can say that again. I've seen matches won and lost simply because one superstar was able to outlast their opponent. Oh. Talk about superstars who don't have an ounce of wit between them. You're looking at them right here. And that's a potentially dangerous mindset to be in. If you're too proud to realize that you're in trouble, you might wind up risking your career for a single match. Hey, you got to be in there every single match and be willing to do whatever it takes. You'd know that if you actually ever step between those ropes. I don't have to have been in a match to realize that jeopardizing my future for the sake of one match is incredibly short-sighted. You know, I'm going to replace you with somebody who actually knows what they're talking about. Maybe Carlito. He might be a little tough to understand sometimes, but at least he knows what it's like to wrestle a match. <laughs> it's crazy to think that we actually get paid to do a job like this. There are thousands of people out there who would do this for free. Really? Maybe I should look into that. I could get a better broadcast partner and save the company some money at the same time. Keep it up, and you're going to find out exactly how tough it is to do this job with your jaw wired shut. Man, this one's turned into a fight, pure and simple. We knew it was going to be intense. We knew it was going to be physical. But I don't think anyone was prepared for this. I got to admit, it took me by surprise, and that doesn't happen often. That's an understatement. You've been in hundreds of matches in your career. We both called hundreds more. We usually have a pretty good idea of what to expect, but not this time. I guess it just goes to show you anything can happen here in the WWE. There isn't an ounce of quit in these superstars. There certainly isn't. They're in this one to the bitter end. I hope this isn't the last time we see these superstars face off. I don't say this too often, but I completely agree with you. This has all the makings of a nice, long rivalry. I don't know how nice it is, but there are certainly some issues between these superstars, and I think this match <coughs> might only exasperate them. Hey, watch your language. This is a family show. I said exasperate. Not, oh, never mind. There's the reversal. One. It's so great seeing these superstars oh. in competition here tonight. I had a feeling they were going to wind up against each other oh. sooner or later. There were times when it seemed like it wasn't going to happen, but I can't oh. tell you how glad I am that it did. That's for sure. You know, any time you throw these kind of combustible elements into a match, you're guaranteed a great show. And that's exactly what we're seeing here tonight. Man, what a match. Kids, if you're watching this, don't... Here's your winner and the new champion, C.M. Punk.